वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू आई होप यू हैव फिट एंड फाइन चिल्ड्रेन टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू स्टार्ट अ न्यू चैप्टर चैप्टर नंबर नाइन अरेंजिंग स्लाइड यूजिंग व्यूज इन माइक्रोसॉफ्ट पावर पॉइंट टू थाउजेंड थर्टीन इन द प्रीवियस चैप्टर यू लर्न अबाउट एडिंग टेक्स्ट एंड पिक्चर्स एंड फॉर्मेटिंग टेक्स्ट ऑन स्लाइड्स टू क्रिएट अ प्रजेंटेशन इन पावर पॉइंट टू थाउजेंड थर्टीन आई होप you watch the video carefully in this chapter we will learn views in powerpoint and uh, arranging slides in a powerpoint let us start today's class the first topic of today's class is powerpoint views powerpoint views means to display the slides of a presentation in a different manners right first of all what is the slide in the previous chapter i told you about what is a slide slide is a uh, slide is an individual page in a presentation right slide is a individual page in a powerpoint presentation so powerpoint views is a powerpoint views means to view the slide of a presentation in a different way right I repeat once again powerpoint views means to show the to display the slide of a presentation in a multiple ways in a different ways right powerpoint provide six types of views just like normal view slide shorter view note page view reading view slide show view and outline view these are the view available in powerpoint 2013 and these views are used to display the slide in a presentation in a different way you can switch between different views right means if you want to switch between if you want to switch one views to other views then you have two options the first option is click on the view button this is a view button and choose the and choose the options present on the presentation views this one click on the if you want to switch Uh, switch from one views to another view click on the view of button sorry view tab and choose the options choose the view in the presentation views this is the first method method or you can also switch, switch between the views by clicking on the views button present on the status bar this is a status bar and this is a view button you can click any one button of your choice or of your requirement according to your requirement right i repeat once again you can switch between different views either by using different option in the presentation views group under the view tab or by using the view buttons on the status bar right next topic is normal view normal view is the default view that display the thumbnails of the slides in your presentation on the left and the current slide for designing on the right side means by default normal view is selected and in the normal view all the slides in your presentation are displayed in the form of thumbnail on the left side and in the right side current slide is displayed for designing can see on the screen this is the normal view right this is the normal view and on the left side on the left side you can see on the left side these are the thumbnails of the slide these are the thumbnails this one right these are the thumbnails of the slides like this and in the right side current slides is display for designing this is the current right you can see on the screen first slide second slide third slide fourth slide this one, like this okay 
I repeat once again by default currents by default normal view normal view is selected and in the normal view all the slides in the presentation are displayed in the form of thumbnails on the left side and in the right side current slide is displayed for design right normal views normal view is used to create and design slides by adding text picture charts and table to the slide in the normal view you can add uh, in the normal view you can create the slide or and you can design the slides by adding text picture charts and table etc right it is also used to rearrange add or delete slides from from the presentation right normal view is used to rearrange delete add slide in the presentation like this if you want to arrange the slide this one second slide is move to another first slide like this and if you want to add slide click on the new slide to the slide and if you want to delete the slide right click on the slide then delete option and delete click on the delete side options like this okay i hope you understand i repeat once again normal uh, in the normal view you can create a slide you can design the slide by adding text pictures etc you can also add notes related to the content for the slide in the normal view by clicking on the notes button if you want to if you want to give uh, if you want to write comment or if you want to uh, if you want to give some extra point about the content of the slide then you type the content in the add notes button this is the this area you can see on the screen this is the add notes click if you want to add uh, notes then click here and type the notes about the content right like this i hope you understand i repeat once again normal view is used to create and design slides rearrange add or delete slide add notes related to the content for the slide right one more thing uh, these notes are not visible while while viewing a slideshow of the presentation when you view the presentation when you view the slideshow then this notes are not display right next view is slide shorter view the slide shorter view display thumbnails of all the slides in your presentation right slide shorter view display thumbnails of all the slides in your presentation this is the uh, uh slide shorter view this this is a thumb this is a slide shorter view in the slide shorter view all the slides are displayed in the form of thumbnails in the normal view all the slides display in the form of thumbnails on the left hand side and current slides is displayed in the right hand side but in the slide shorter view all the slides all the slides are displayed in the form of thumbnails right there's a difference between normal views and slide shorter view slide shorter view is used to change the order of the slides by clicking and dragging a slide to a new location in the slide shorter view you can change the order of the slide by clicking and dragging it a slide to a new location like this if you want to change the order of the slide then select the slide click on the, the click on that slide which you want to move to the new location new, new location then drag it like this right and you can slide shorter view provide an overall view of different slides in a presentation 
you can insert or delete slide also in a slide shutter view right slide shutter view provide an overall view of your presentation or you can add or delete slide also in a slide shutter view like this duplicate delete slide delete slide delete okay. I repeat once again slide shutter view display thumbnails of all the slides in your presentation it is used to change the order of the slides by clicking and dragging a slide to a new location if you want to in the order of the slide then select the slide and drag it to the new location you can insert or delete slide in the slide shutter view also the next view is the reading view in the reading view display a presentation not in the full screen mode but as a slideshow that fits within the window means when you want to view the slides as a slideshow not in a full screen mode but within a window then you should use reading view reading view is used to display the all the slide as a slideshow within the window not in the full screen okay, like this this is a reading view right. you can see this view is not display in the full screen just in the it display slides within the window like this okay in this view controls appear on the status bar that can be used to Play the slideshow and uh, move between previous and next slide using control on the status bar. This is a next view is slideshow view. What is a slideshow? A slideshow is a sequential display of slides in the full screen mode. Right? Slideshow is a sequential display. Of a slide in the full screen mode. It is used to play the slides when you want to show your presentation to an audience. If your presentation is ready and if you want to display it in front of the audience, then you should use slideshow. Right? It is also used to check the effect that you have applied on text and other object on the slides. In slideshow view you can check the effect you can send the animation which you apply on the slides right slideshow view uh, it is very important it is very useful view most of time we are using this view so how you run a uh, how you run a slideshow you have to four options to run a slideshow right you have four options to run a slideshow. The first method is click on the start from begin button on the quick access toolbar. This is a quick access. start beginning button. This one, right? Click on this button. You can see this is a slideshow view. Second method is click on the slideshow button on the status bar. This is a slideshow button in the status bar. Click on this button. Right. Like this. Okay. There is difference between start from beginning button and slideshow button slideshow button start the slideshow from the slide you are currently selected and start from beginning 
button is used to start the slideshow from the first slide right start when you click on the start slideshow start from beginning button then your slideshow will start from the first slide and if you are you if you click on slideshow button then you then your slide show will start from the current from the current selected slides right now i am uh, third slide is selected so if we if we click on slideshow button then it is start from third slides right third step third method is click on the slideshow tab this is a slideshow tab choose from the following option in the start slideshow group there are start slide show group choose from beginning or from current slide if you are choosing from beginning option then your slide show will start from the beginning from the first slide and if you are using from current slide then you your slide show will start from the current selected slide like this <coughs> This is a slideshow. Yeah, I hope you understand. Right. Fourth option is press F5 to start a slideshow. Like this. Okay. So you have four options to run a slideshow. I repeat once again the first option is click on the sli start slide start from beginning button on the quick access toolbar second option is click on the slideshow button on the status bar third option is click on the slideshow tab and choose the from beginning options or from current slide option in the start slideshow group or you can press f5 from the keyboard right Next view, next view is notes page view. Notes page view is available only from the view tab. Notes page, notes page view is only available in the view tab. This is a note page view. Notes page view. This view is used to add notes by you. If you write any notes on any slide, then in this view you can this, uh, see that see that notes uh, or you can also add notes for the slide and if you want to write a notes in the slide then you can write notes in the notes page view right i hope you understand notes page view is only available in view tab and it is used to display the notes if uh, which you are write in uh, any slide or you can write any notes in any slides next view is outline view this view this is a outline view outline view is available from the view tab it is also available only in view tab and this view is used to view the text of the slide in outline form view in the view in the outline view you can display all the text which you are written in the slides in the outline form you can see on the left side of the screen this is a this this is a text all the text which is uh, which is written in the slides you can also move text from one slide to another slide easily if you want to move any text from one slide to another slide then you should move text in this view in a very easy way right like this like this okay if you want to move any text from one slide to another slide then you should use outline right so these are the view available in microsoft powerpoint the next topic is arranging slides while working with slides in powerpoint you may want to delete some slides or change the order of the slide in the presentation arranging slide means to change the order 
of the slides or to change the and uh, to delete any extra slide right so this is and this is called the arranging slides right right arranging slide means to delete any slides and uh, uh, or uh, to change the order of the slide in the presentation so the first is deleting slide deleting slides how you delete a slides what is the step to delete a slide select it either in the normal view or in the slide shorter view and press the delete key if you want to delete any slides then you select the select that slide in normal view as well as slide shorter view this is the normal view if you want to delete this slide then select the slide and you can also select that slide in slide shorter view like this and press delete button from the keyboard right like this suppose select the slide and press delete button slide will be deleted it is an hour it is in a normal view and if you, you want to delete slide from the slide shorter view then select the slide and delete button so in this way you have you can delete the slide right if you want to delete any slide then you should select that slide in normal view as well as in slide shorter view and after selecting the slide press delete button next is changing order of slide changing order of slide you can change the sequence of the slide by using any one of the following method right means you have two options to arrange the slide the first option is select the thumbnail of the slide in the normal view and then drag it to the desired position if you want to arrange the slides then you have two options the first of in the first option select the slide which you want to drag in the normal view select the thumbnail if you want to right now select the slide and drag it to the like this select the thumbnails of the slide in the normal view and drag it to new location like this okay in the normal view can choose right or second option is select the thumbnails of the slide in the slide shorter view and then drag it to the desired position select the slide in the slide shorter view select the thumbnail of the slide which you want to drag and move it to the drag it right so in this way you can change the order of the slide i repeat once again to change the order of the slide you have two options the first option in the normal view select the thumbnails of the slides and drag it to the new location <clears throat> and select the slide in slide uh, select the slide in slide shorter view this is slide shorter view select the slide and drag it to the new location right so in this way we have completed this chapter i hope you understand watch the video again and again okay thank you